Let's see. Marksman specialist has fangs. Giant specialist has fangs and forts. Speed spec. Let's go giant. is gonna be here but maybe we'll sell out of sledges when we get forts so we can just use sledges as forts now oh my god You would expect forts, but it's mass sledge carry instead. Ah, of course, smart. I wish you could have a separate MMR so you can experiment, play for fun. Well, far be it for me to recommend that you should smurf, but if you borrow Mechabellum from a family account to another Steam ID and you relock your Steam launcher, you can play on a new account. Just for testing though, don't abuse it for, um, don't abuse it for, like, ego boosting and bottom feeding. Or just run the lobby, there's no MOR in lobby. Do people join that, actually? Our Tarantula, strength-wise, they kind of dominate the first four rounds. And then you need a very special setup to be able to continue using them or even get tech on them. When they came out, they were considered to be the strongest. They did get a 5% health nerf, which is not insignificant. Uh, but people are no longer spamming mass techs on them at the moment. Like, um, they can spawn mines. They're a good early unit. We can either start fiddling with his backside with Wasp or we can get a Scorpion to deal with uh, the Tarantulas. Steel Ball also possible but a little weird. And then there's a Typhoon which is all really also not bad. We could go Mass Typhoon with barriers too. Shall we try that? No, it sucks ass against Scorpions. Um... If he gets Scorps, am I happy for it fanging? Maybe. Let's go for my my special wasp operative. Operative wasp engage. Next round we get Fang, um, range, maybe. Typhoon Phoenix, interesting. Typhoon and Phoenix. That's scary for our wasps. Luckily, they're distracted with killing our entire Fang line. What is he, by the way? Cost control specialist. Oh, so he's very good at countering. No, he's gonna kill our tower first, which means our wasp won't get the kill on the tower. Unfortunate. It is a wash. <laughs> I bet it's on cost control spec. Yeah. It's pretty dumb. I could still start like using my wasps here and there but against typhoon it really feels like an exercise in futility they would be a way to kill the two crawlers though and i i think that still makes sense unless we want to get a fort now but of course he has phoenix uh elite mustangs not fantastic against typhoon i suppose they are level three which is pretty cool but i think mustang is quite
Tarantula level 2. This is looking nice. Our wasp will get the tower kill unless the typhoon kill the wasps. Yeah. They will get the tower kill. Nice. We'll still lose. <coughs> we'll still lose, right? Or do we have enough stuff? Maybe and maybe they'll clear a missile. Kill tower, kill clear missile. Or not clear missile. Just win. Nice. Good. Good. Kirby, are you interested in any grand strategy games like EU and Europa Universalis? I am very interested in it. But I don't think it's uh, viable for stream. Advanced powertrain. Don't think so. I don't think so. I don't I watch something like that. Yeah, but I I get a much better um I get a much better impression from audience numbers than uh, some people saying uh, they will watch it no matter how genuine. I believe you and I would watch something like that, but it wouldn't be enough people. Scorpion. And right to the face, too. But because it's level 2, it doesn't die as fast. Though damage is damage, of course. Dude, he's one-shotting uh, Typhoons. These fangs are quite nice. Distraction. Nice, nice, nice. Tower gonna die. Tower, will it die on time? Yes. Good. That's great. And this time, do we pop the missile? Nope. Alright, just another solid win. Very similar to last game, despite the uh, scorpion. Uh, locking on to the port. Port is now level 3 actually, which is pretty sick. That makes barrier a lot better too. We could also go intensive training, fort level 2 on the left. Or we get the tech research, but that needs 3 techs to be worth it. Like, what, what would I get on fangs this round to have that be worth it? How, to, how would that ever be worth it on typhoons? Like, we could get barrier, I mean portable shield I guess. Too intensive training. What would I recover? Maybe these sledges. Though they did do some delay, to be honest. But um, I think their time has come. We haven't summoned any units, and I think it has to be... Um, maybe more fangs, because we need some fangs in front of the scorpions. I don't know. 
What did he get? A double shot, okay. Double shot. Very good against Scorps. He is definitely full committing. He's getting one shot. <laughs> oh my god. Four to freaking Giga Chat. Yeah, you got another set of Phoenixes. He could go like charge shot. He does have 150 credits for charge shot. At this point, Fangs are actually looking pretty solid. Like late Fangs. He could go like Mech Rage. We'll add a bit of damage as well. But to be honest, it's the Forts that's winning this. We could get Fang production on the Forts too. Or just get Mass Forts. Shall I keep Wraith? Like, Phoenixes will kill the Wraith, right? But is it actually not pretty good? committing is better I'm surprised he's never dealt with the wasp so far. Mechanical rage, crawlers, and replicate too. Yeah, I'm playing multiplayer. This is looking pretty good. He is gonna break through though. Scorpions are getting pretty mad labs. Shablamo. Even went for the Overlord. Dude, the fact that this one is level 3, soon 4, is so insane. This is everything. I mean, he kind of deserves this loss. He went for Typhoons, which is a shit unit. Every time I go Typhoon, I feel like they're really, really over... Like, overly expensive. They're very expensive and they don't give you much. Oh, and he's cost control, yeah. Elite arc lines, redeployment, heavy armor. No way. <laughs> 350,000. Can't upgrade any of our main units anymore. But we can get range or move speed or missiles. with EMP and energy absorption final chance 
He kills the barriers very fast because of it. Smart. Oh, this is looking scary. That was a nice, uh, nice choice by him. But I think it will take too long to channel the laser on most of our forts, no? To uh, actually... Like, this guy just won't die to his melt here just because he has just too much health. He's just gonna win. This is that cool. Oh, never mind, he has energy absorption. <laughs> but look at this! Absorb this! Pants grab. GG, well played. Cool. Nice. Was too stubborn about the scores. Seems a good idea, to be honest. Oh, I don't have to read our chat for you guys anymore because I'm not covering it. I think this is a better place for my camera to be. I block like one quarter of one of the four tech, but you can see chat and I'm no longer in the middle. Supply spec or giant? Giant just saves us 200. Supply will save us more than 200. Let's go supply. You're simply meant to not have forts going so far forward, so there's room for chaff to stick out in front of their shields so chaff dies. Okay, okay. I kind of hate, hate how this game is relentlessly green. I love it. I think green is the best color. I think green is by far the best color. And I wish every map in every game was green. I even... Like Warcraft 3 green maps are by far the best as well. And I wish they were all green, but they're not. Cataclysmo? Yeah, I uh, watched Loco play it. I saw enough to know that I don't think it'll be a staying power game for me. It looks fun, it looks good, but it could look better. Ouch. Stormcaller is too OP against Fangs. You look fun, you look good, but you could look better. True. Oh, it's late. Elite Mustang. I don't think you want, really want Elite Mustang when it comes to missile interceptors. I think you want Missile Strike. Can either get mech rage or range enhancement. Let's do mech rage first. Is it secret? Is it symmetric? Okay. Oh no. Really? Why would you spend money on that so soon? Are you making Fang Hacker Strat? Uh, probably Ford. Why would you do oil so soon? Now what? Now what's up? You gonna shoot at me with your rockets? What rockets? I'm as happy as the Harkonnen Chief bathing in black liquid. 
Super early oil means you get it back. Yeah, that's true, I guess. That makes sense. I saw it as like a big waste of momentum if it doesn't work. He's gonna burn you next round? Nah, there's no way he's gonna burn me. Why would he do that? Oh, those storms are eating well. Yeah, boys. No, boys. If he goes Vulcan now, uh, he doesn't have money for Vulcan. He would have to, like, invest everything he has in getting a single Vulcan. Why would he do that? Oh, efficient giant manufacturing. Very good. Very good for me. Hey, I can't click this. With so many fangs, isn't it time to consider fang anything. POV instead of being a crawler POV enthusiast? What? Why can't I click this? I can't click any of my units. What the fuck? It's bugged. I'll tab in, tab out. Didn't do anything. I had the same bug, just spawned something. Okay. Oh, thank God. Whew. Saved. Uh, is it time Fang POV? Yeah, but I don't want to give away what I'm going to be doing, you see. I don't want to give away the secret. Vexorist. Orbital Strike. And Mustangs. Should have sold these balls, man. Wasp is not gonna work because he's got stanks in the back. Farseer is quite solid against him actually. Phoenix looks pretty valueless. And Badgers could work. But I think uh, it's a Farseer. I think it's a Farseer. Let's uh, fortify this side. Get some late fangs up in here. Up in here. Up in here. Okay, what, what does the Farseer say? Farseer third, bold choice. <laughs> Maybe we'll use three Farseers and go MI. Whoa, he's Mustangs and range. So he is correct in that Mustangs kind of beat Fangs, especially with range. But I find that eventually that ceases to be true. And I feel like Farseer will beat everything here. Am I wrong? Maybe it's too slow. Like he's killing how many stangs in a row? One at a time? Maybe three, it depends on the luck of the hit. And the tower dies. Sheesh. That's some stang level ups for him for sure.
Let's see Mustangs break barrier. Yeah. Assault Fortress. I don't think we want that. Or do we? Movement speed? 10 range less. Maybe we do. So you can keep up with the forts. Yeah, I think we do want that actually. There was also Mustang production line, which would have been fine. We want that a lot, yeah. Okay, Fang range was like way overdue. Now we have it. Huh, it's just killing. Oh, okay. I see. So it's gonna be a backdoor tower. That's sad. Maybe sell Overseer next round for Forge and Barrier. You want me to sell the Farce here? Kind of a weird positioning. No, because he knows they're gonna be pulled towards the Phoenix. Unless. I do have range, actually. No, he's gonna miss some, right? No, he's got it all. He did kill one Phoenix. Uh, unlucky boys. Stanks with negative damage against the fort. Yeah, that's another win round because of the the smart reach around. Took uh, about six and five hundred fifty damage. Worm, three squads of level three marksmen. Valueless. He has a Mustang, so we know he's gonna go for a giant unit. I think he's gonna go for a level two sandworm now. So we could get uh, Marksman to deal with it. We can also get Overlord, but then he can click MI and deny my hits. I think it's Marks to deal with. Um, to deal with worm there's gonna be a worm forts now instead of what did we have two should be nice looking pretty good looking pretty good for now marksman trying to do what he can against the worm it helps you know it helps all right this is good this is good we have uh we have a good thing going here Very nice. That was great. Overlord and Force to help with Chaff Clear. I don't think I should do that. I think I should do attack damage on uh, Fangs.
10 range. It's a bit greedy. 400 money for that. This is 650, that's too much. We could just get this attack and trade. I borrowed for nothing. A random wasp? I wanted to deal with the worm easily. No, hacker would die, dark demon. Do I have enough? I think so. Yeah. It's just two storm callers. That's not gonna cut it. Nice. Good shit. This is good. It's not over, but we'll win next round, I think. Unless something crazy happens. Amp core, intensive training. Okay, we'll take the training. Could do fang generation. Let's see how much money we have left. a lot um, I think another fort is better than getting a, a tech upgrade here can do some late barriers too You might back your phoenix again with missile. With missile? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have one deployment left. Two if I want. I could get one storm caller. <laughs> that was definitely optimal. Let's see it. 600 damage so far. Oh shit, he has Melters. Oh no. Oh no. My level 3 fort. And the EMP? Oh my god, I lost. Oh shit. I lost. I freaking lost. Unless... Hold up. Hold up, the storm callers. The storm callers! Yo! Ah oh, shit, my tower. No! Well, this <laughs> The storm callers! Come on! <laughs> it's a draw. <laughs> oh man. That's crazy, dude. This is just It's the storm callers. It's just so good. What can you say?
crawlers in front, I think. Shield the whole thing. Or does it work because of the EMP? Ah. Smart. EMP is so fast. Maybe I should have done uh, missile interceptors. The fangs? The fangs? Protecting the forts for now? I think that's it. I think fang production was it. Yeah. Oh, poor, poor Melter. Having some trouble killing, huh? Yeah, nice. GG, well played. Cool. Very cool. Hey, I just asked you about Fang production. Nice to see it in use. Oh, yeah. Fang production insane on seven forts. True. True. I I got that tip from chat, the fang production. This one's on you. Did we find out the counter to fang fort? It has no counter. We became the user instead of the counterer. <laughs> <laughs>